first run of 2021. Yeah, he's still there. There we go, end of the first fish of the year. And the new orange braid. Don't really know what size this is, it hasn't kicked. He's not that big. Go, lovely. Here we go. First fish of the year. Let's hope that they get a bit bigger. <laughs> All right, guys, welcome to another video. Um, first session of 2021, um, minus six in the car on the way down, so I was actually sort of thinking that we would have struggled, but been been decent so far, um, four fish to, you know, 14 pound I think was the biggest there, um, but yeah, good to get out, finally get the, get the first fish out of the way and, um, and see how things go then the rest of the day, well, not even halfway through the day yet, a couple of decent baits out there. We're really fishing for for one big fish, so see how things go anyway. Um, but yeah, nice day to be out on the boat. Fish number two. Didn't even know that the fish was on. Lifted the rod to do a bit of a recast, hence the reason there's no camera photos of the strike. A bit more weight than the first one, I think. Yeah, a bit more weight to this one. Oh dear. Not really a much bigger fish, but... Oh, come on. Oh, yeah. That's meant solid. He's meant around the anchor, has he? There's no stopping him there. I don't know, he's second time. I've got to bring it. I can't get it. That's a... So fish number two. Um, we actually didn't know that, that we had a fish on. Um, I went to do a recast and, and struck into the fish. So it must have just been as I was uh, lifting the rod because it uh, was hooked really lightly but for such a small fish it caused quite a bit of quite a bit of havoc uh, right around the anchor I decided then to, to move the whole boat and tangle all the rods so they're getting bigger number two for the year So, dead baiting has uh, slowed down completely. So we're going to cast a few lures over the over the a bit of a weedy area that I know quite well. From memory, it's about seven or eight foot in there, but it's, it's dense weed that comes up about four foot off the bottom, maybe slightly more. But um, it's usually a really good holding area for fish. So sticking with the goby shad that I'm sure you have probably sick of seeing now over the last few videos. But it's working so don't particularly want to change it just yet. Um, just all the weight I have on is a 3 gram spike. So it's just bringing it down just enough where I can bring it in as slow as I want without it sinking to the bottom and getting stuck in the weed. Don't want to reel too fast. 
as I don't think we'll be chasing nobody well today with the cold water. Just every now and then impart a bit of speed and uh, just to try and get a reaction if there is something following it. Be interesting to see. Nice and clear water. Almost good. Can you move and then you're thinking of moving and you're going to move 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 and you're going to move
it's uh it's it's quite nice like that so yeah uh thanks for tuning in and uh see you on the next video